While there are a lot of educational opportunities and options available to parents today, I guess the question would be, why would anyone send their kid to a Catholic school in particular? Why would anyone send their kid to this school, Sacred Heart? I guess it has to do with what do we think the goal of education is? What do we think like the goal of these children's lives are? Is it to simply get them good careers? Is it simply to get them into to high schools or to get them into good four-year universities or professions? Yeah, that's important stuff, but ultimately the goal of every one of our lives is to become a saint, you know, to reach that destiny, to be with the Lord forever in eternity in heaven. And like so much of what a Catholic education provides is, of course, that incredible educational foundation, but also the integration of the faith within every part of education, right? Because to be a Catholic is to not just simply be someone who goes to church on Sundays, it's to be like a disciple maker out in the world, someone who brings to bear in the world that encounter with Jesus that changes the world, that does, you know, what the great saints have done, the Mother Teresa's, the John Paul II's, the France of Assisi, Francis Xavier, like all these saints, from their encounter with Jesus went out into the world and changed history, right? So we don't, we're not just simply interested in educating minds, you know, forming minds, do you know the content? Do you know math? Do you know science? Do you know reading? Do you know religion? But it's, do you know Jesus, right? Jesus who is the word, Jesus who is the logos, he's the truth, right? Can you encounter the logos? Can you encounter Jesus in math? Can you encounter him? Do you see him present in science? Do you see him in great literature and art and music? Do you see him everywhere, right? That's the whole Catholic ethos, the Catholic way of being. You know, the other thing I would say is as the culture around us becomes more and more unhinged and unmoored from truth, we need like a stable vision, a stable foundation to pass on to children, right? We need our kids to come to know truth with a capital T, that's Jesus, right? And all of the lowercase true T truths in relation to him. This is a place where they will be not just simply taught, but this is a place where they will be formed, the whole person, where they'll be formed, their heart, their mind, their soul, everything will be formed uh, to prepare them to go out into the world as, uh, as disciples, as people who are gonna change the world. That we get to learn about Jesus. If we were at a public school, we'd have to probably come here like on Sunday and learn about him, but I get to learn about him every day. Well, my favorite thing to do was probably Damascus because it just really changed me with my Catholic faith. It brought me really closer with my friends, my family, and God. And that was a lot to me because I was never really that close with him. First communion felt really good because we were getting Jesus and that's really special for kids to get Jesus. We want our kids to, to learn when they're young about Jesus and how to have a relationship with Jesus. And you know, seemingly there's less and less places to, to even talk about, talk about God. And we needed a school where God was at the center, and that's what Sacred Heart gives. Uh, not only in the focus on, on, on Christ, but also you know, teaching our kids about the Catholic faith and why it's important and how beautiful it is and how exciting and fun it can be. And uh, giving them the opportunity to be surrounded by great teachers that also feel the same way. I can't think of a more important thing to, to start to teach our kids at a young age than, than how to encounter Christ in their everyday life. And that, and that was really the main focus of why we wanted to uh, send our kids to Sacred Heart. I am a third grade teacher here at Sacred Heart. A few of the many things that I love about our school here is the fact that we have such a strong community. We are constantly praying for people in need. The students are bringing their special prayer intentions um, to their classmates, to their teachers, to the staff here, and everybody is kind of willing to jump in and help out in the most powerful way we can through prayer. One of the things that I've come to really love and appreciate about this school is the community, right? The community dimension, the family dimension of the school. And you really feel that in these classrooms, especially the, like they're not gigantic classrooms. We don't have one teacher trying to teach 40 kids in a classroom. They're smaller class sizes, which creates an opportunity for greater one-to-one -one connection, mentoring even between teacher and student. And again, that's part of the vision of Catholic formation, Catholic education, because the faith is not something, it's not a, a list of content that has to be transmitted. It is a, it's a living relationship that gets that gets shared, and that only happens within, you know, sort of close quarters contact, right? So, these smaller class sizes allow for even greater teacher to student interaction, 
which allows the faith to become even more alive for them. And the family dimension of the school, seeing the way that upper grades interact with younger grades, it just creates a sort of culture of mentoring and discipleship that really bleeds into everything. And it's a real blessing for the school. Well, the friends here, you get to be with them like throughout all nine years you've been here since kindergarten. And you're like always with them and they become your best friends. And like, like you have all these memories with them and that's just a really great experience that like other schools don't get. You get to like stay with the same people and build like a really great bond. Hello, my name is John Chaplicki and I'm principal here at Sacred Heart of Jesus School. One of the most amazing and compelling aspects to our school culture, to why we exist, is to bring our students into a deeper relationship with Jesus to provide amazing encounter experiences for them. Experiences that go from the classroom to things like weekly mass, special prayer services and rosaries held during the months of October and May, stations of the cross and service-based opportunities all geared to the same purpose, and that's to help our students grow closer to Jesus. If you're looking for an authentically Catholic experience for your children, there is no better place than Sacred Heart of Jesus School.